Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be talking about my top 5 favorite battle systems in RPGs. These in my opinion are the best battle systems I've encountered in RPG games that make the games a lot of fun to play, especially when it comes to the battling in the games. So with that being said, we're going to list my 5 favorites. This is in no order, this is just the 5 that I had the most fun with, and the 5 battle systems are the best of any RPG that I've played. Keep in mind this is strictly turn based, we're not talking about action RPG or anything like that here it's all turn based all right guys so the first one i'm going to mention at uh, number one super mario rpg legend of the seven stars for the super nintendo this game has an incredible battle system the battle system in the game basically it's all about timing so whenever you do an attack if you press the button right before you attack you do more damage and the attack does like a cool fancy animation and also this not only applies to when you do your normal attacks but it also applies to when you do special attacks not only does it apply to when you do attacking in Super Mario RPG, but another really cool thing is that when you're also defending against enemy attacks right before the enemy hits you, if you press the button at the right time, you can lower the amount of damage you take from attacks and block against the attack. Super Mario RPG is just one of the funnest games out there, and one of the big reasons why is because of the super fun battle system in the game. So at our first entry, we have Super Mario RPG for the Super Nintendo. Let's move on to our second entry on this list. And at number two, we have The Legend of Dragoon for the PlayStation 1. The Legend of Dragoon coming in at entry number two for PlayStation 1 has got to have one of the funnest battle systems in any games ever. In The Legend of Dragoon, when you do attacks, you do what are called additions. And basically, you have to hit multiple timings on the attack and... To master some of the most difficult attacks in Legend of Dragoon, the hardest additions in the game, it will require a tremendous amount of player skill and a tremendous amount of practice. And the battle system really rewards the player learning the timing of the attacks and really mastering the additions. Legend of Dragoon is another super good game on this list. If you're looking for an RPG with an absolutely incredible battle system, Legend of the Dragoon is a must play on the PlayStation 1. This game has one of the best battle systems in RPG out there, and there's a good reason why a lot of people consider it one of the best RPGs on the PlayStation 1. Coming in at number 3, we have Shadow Hearts for the PlayStation 2. This game is another game where the battle system is just absolutely incredible, so the battle system of Shadow Hearts basically revolves around a mechanic called the Judgment Ring. Whenever you go to attack, a ring will appear and then a line will spin around and there's certain parts of the ring where you have to press the button whenever the line goes past it. On the ring though, there's usually a small part of the ring that's usually a reg section that's very small where if you press the button right as the line goes past there, you can basically get bonus damage on an attack or if you're using like a healing ability or item, the Judgment Ring also appears and can heal for more or give somebody more of an effect from an item or ability. This game requires great timing for the battle system. It forces the player to pay attention to the combat and the battle system has a very straightforward easy learning curve and is simple to pick up but difficult to master. Shadow Hearts overall another game with a really incredible battle system. Another game that if you're looking for a JRPG with a great battle system is a must play game. Alright guys, for number 4 we got Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne for the PlayStation 2 and also re-released in the HD remake on the Nintendo Switch, PC, and also the PlayStation 4 as well. Shin Megami Tensei 3 Nocturne is one of my favorite RPG games of all time and this game uses the press turn battle system. This battle system basically has four press turn icons. Whenever you get a critical hit or you hit enemy weakness, you get an additional half turn. One of the unique things of Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne is that if you resist an enemy attack, an enemy can lose many turns. But another unique thing that makes the press turn battle system so incredibly good in Shin Megami Tensei 3 Nocturne is that you can only have half a turn be used with a character if you would like. So when you get to a person's turn, instead of going to defend or using a command, what you can do is do what's called a pass. And by passing your turn, you'll only use up half of a turn. So this is something that really makes the battle system very strategic. The game is a ton of fun to play. If you're really into monster collecting RPGs, and like RPGs with a great challenge, Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne is an absolute must-play RPG game. 
All right, guys, this is it. Our number five entry, the final entry on my top five favorite JRPG battle systems. We got Grandia. This could be from any of the Grandia games. The Grandia series is a fantastic battle system. Basically, what happens is you can see where the turns are, and right before an enemy gets a turn, you can do an attack and hit them, and you can cancel them from getting their turn and stop them from doing their attack. If you time it right and you hit an enemy just as they're about to do their attack, you can push your turn further back and allow yourself to get more turns and prevent the enemy from getting turns. If you're really, really good at the battle system, then you can prevent enemies from getting a turn in a battle completely if you time your attacks at the right time. There's a ton of depth to the Grandia combat system. It really is one of the funnest turn-based combat systems out there. Grandia has always been one of my favorite RPG series, and one of the big reasons why is because of the incredible battle systems in the Grandia games. Overall, that is my list for my top five favorite JRPG battle systems. I want to say thank you very much for watching the entire video. I really greatly appreciate it. I would like to say to make sure to check out my Twitch channel at twitch.tv backslash shockstorm. Go over to the Twitch channel, give me a follow. I do full playthroughs of RPGs and other types of games there, and then I review them here on the RPG channel. I want to say thank you all so much. I really appreciate everybody watching this video. And also, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel. I really greatly appreciate it. And with that being said, I want to say thank you all so much, everybody. Everyone have a great day, and I'll catch you all in the next video. Have a great day, everybody.